Ambrose would be in a Premier League title race if he joined Arsenal, which is a huge opportunity. Ambrose told TalkSport, these opportunities don't come around all the time. To go to Arsenal, he's competing for the Premier League title. A lot of people say you owe Brighton or you owe this team and that team, players don't owe football clubs, the same as football clubs don't owe players. Eve, Bissoma was playing, if Bissoma was still there and didn't go to Spurs, Caicedo may not even be in the team. What I'm saying is certain situations could happen. I wouldn't wish any bad stuff or injuries on people, but you never know. Following Caicedo's social media post, Brighton reportedly asked the youngster to stay at home until the end of the transfer window. Ambrose believes that both parties haven't handled the situation poorly, but the midfielder staying at home doesn't bode well for either. He said, Brighton haven't, handled it badly, and I don't think anyone has. I don't think Caicedo has to a certain degree. The boy wants to leave, he wants to leave Brighton. We can say it's his agent or not, his agent hasn't written that and then Caicedo doesn't know what's gone on and they've said go home. The boy wants to leave Brighton. There's no winner in this situation. Not many would have expected Arsenal to compete for the Premier League title at the start of the season. However, they currently have a five-point lead over second-placed Manchester City with a game in hand. The Gunners have signed versatile attacker Leandro Trossard and Polish centre-back Jakub Kiwior in the January transfer window. They now need cover in midfield due to Mohamed Elneny's injury issues and Thomas Pretty's fitness history. Signing a player of the calibre of Caicedo could be a big move for the club. The Brighton man has made 21 appearances across competitions this season, scoring one goal and assisting another.